Hey guy, hey, what's up? It's David here. Uh, welcome to the channel. This is our vlog 27. It's going to be on some world coins. Um, just having a quick look. I think they're, they're all silver coins. So, a bit of a silver lining. Okay, um, get cracking straight into it. The first one we have is from Austria. It's a 10 shilling from 1973. It's almost uncirculated. Look at that. Nice and shiny. Hope that comes up all right. And I'll show you the other side. Lovely coin. Uh, next one is um, from Belgium. Oh, this is, um, I don't think this is uh, silver, but um, it's from 1912. Um, uncirculated, even though it's toned. It's a centimetre, one centimetre. I'll just show you the other side again. It's, um, it's, it's like a, looks like a line. I'll just get a nice close up of that. Lovely looking coin. Uh, next one is from Egypt. Uh, two tenths of a quash, I think it's pronounced. Fine to very fine condition. And that's the other side there. I buy, I buy all these coins on eBay. Uh, next one we've got a 1900 Hong Kong 10 cent silver. Side there, lovely condition. Uh, next one is from Hungary, it's a uh, one corona from 1912.835 silver. Yeah, the other side. Next one is from India, 1904, two Anis silver coin. It's a very small coin. That's the other side. Okay, next up we have um, from Turkey, five para. This one's from 1910, in very fine condition. I hope they're coming up nice and clear there for you. Well, I've got you here. If you can hit that subscribe button and give us a, a thumbs up, it would be greatly appreciated. Okay, next we have a uh, Russia 1909 10 Kopecks in uh, fine to very fine condition. Nice looking coin on the back there. Nice design. Okay, next one is Russia again, 1914. Um, okay, it's 10 kopecks. That's the other side there. Okay, next we go to Switzerland, 1903, um, five Rappen, in very fine condition. And that's the other side there. Okay, still in Switzerland. This is a 1891 20 wrapping in 
very fine condition. That's uh, the other side there. Okay, and the last last few I have here, they're from Germany. <clears throat> they all got um, different mint marks on it. This is a 1905 um, silver half mark. Um, it's got a mint mark of D. D for David, after me? I don't think so. Just back over there. Okay, this one is a 1905 half mark, but this has got a mint mark of J. in very fine condition as well. It's got here a harder date to get with the mint mark. Okay, the next one is um, 1906 mint mark, half mark, EF condition. Nice and shiny, beautiful. Next one is a 1906 D mint mark in fine condition, um, half mark. Next one, Germany again, half mark, 1906. In EF condition, D mint mark. You know what the the letters stand for? Drop it in the notes for me, in the comment section, to help me out. And this is in lovely condition. A lot of luster on that. Uh, the next one is um, nineteen oh six. Mint mark E half mark, in very fine condition. That is, um, it's got some luster on that as well. Looks almost new. Okay, the next one is 1906 J mint mark, in uh, good, good, very fine condition half mark. Mint mark J, J for Johnny. <laughs> Okay, that's one side there. In really nice condition. Like I said, I get all these on eBay. Uh, next is 1907, half mark, uh, good fine condition. Germany again, mint mark A. A for Apple, Australia. And the last one we've got is a 1918 A mint mark half mark in very fine condition. Okay, that's it for uh, this lot. I've got to do, be doing another one with some well, well coins with silver in it as well. Uh, that'll be in the next one. And then uh, after that, there'll be... Um, my buys of the week, what, what I bought for the week. Okay, uh, if you can just um, hit that subscribe button there, give us a big thumbs up, hit the notification bell, so all my videos will come to your inbox, and um, comments, please comment, and um, I'll get back to you on, on the comment, comments, I'll reply to all comments, and um, until the next video, stay safe, have a great day, ciao, thanks for watching, bye-bye.